Welcome back. Uh, we, Team Shogi Harbor, are going to compete in this streamer fest team battle uh, between five different teams that are for Japanese players uh, that I guess are YouTubers and such. Uh, and we, the loyal English speaking fans around the world, in Team Shogi Harbor. So, we'll see just how things go. Uh, I don't have any particular expectations for our team, other than we'll give it our best and we'll try to have fun. And hopefully other teams will also give it their best and have fun. And Ten, we'll see where we end nine, up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, Good luck, one. everyone. All right, good luck. Uh, my turn. Let's play some third foul rook. Try not to get too embarrassed. Um, uh, okay. Let's defend this. Oh, right, this thing. Um, well, I unwittingly transposed into something painful. That's cool, I guess. Um, yeah, I fucked up. All right, so what do we do? Play it off like we did this intentionally, I guess. I don't know what else we can do at this point. Um, try to defend our king. Uh, oh, right, that's a good defensive move. I'll follow suit, but it's not smart. So now I actually threatened to take their pawns. So they're going to take... They didn't. All right, so we can... Maybe have a normal-ish game, maybe, if we're lucky. Um, they might have also bishop 5-5. Five five. Right, so let's oppose this rook and try to get the king back into our castle and Let's see. Okay, so I should meet this kind of similarly. Um, okay, this is interesting. I'm not sure how to meet that. Oh, I am super unsure how to meet that. Um... I guess we push on the edge. So, okay, the center button is impasse, which we're not going to need anytime soon. But if we do need it, it's there. So now I offer this bishop exchange, which I expect they'll take. Which is why I was so hesitant to offer it. Um... Hmm. But yeah, I don't know how to make progress here. Um. It's confusing. Oh, that's risky. Everything I can do here is risky. I guess we have to take this. Um, I don't know, man. 
So we'll try to defend some spaces and see how this goes. Defend the head of the rook. And also indirectly defend our lance. Well, we've played one move that's made them think. So we've done one good thing this game. Um, am I forced to take this? Probably. Do I want to take it? Also, yes. I'm concerned because I don't see their idea. But sitting here is not going to help me find what they're planning. Okay. St oh, okay. I still don't understand it. I'm still, still confused. What is the thought here? Oh, well, okay. <sighs> it's not easy to counter. Um, If they take, I can drop the bishop to fork their bishop and rook. If they don't take, their rook moves away from my king. But I'm still in trouble. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know, man. This game's hard. We're giving up the lance. Um, Oh, they can trap my... Well, no, it's not a trap, because I still can take the knight. Hmm.
What's the time control again? Uh, three second increment. That's not going to be enough. Hmm. If silver advance, I trap their horse. This is spooky. Yep, 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 I hear ya. Um... Guess we'll retreat that. I'm getting dunked on. Yeah, okay, you win this. Good game. So... That's generally how I think these games might go for me. This is a really strong feel. Like, everybody in Japan, a lot of people in Japan play Shogi at a good standard. So, for the rest of the world, this is quite the wake-up call. All right, I play as go to this game. I'll offer a bishop exchange, even though I don't really want it, but um, it's okay. Okay, we got this wild position, um, which I assume is fine. Well, that's interesting. If they bring their king out, I might exchange bishops, even though I'm not super great at this opening. Um, we put our king somewhere safe. Let's do this exchange before their king can take back. Um, I think this line is playable. So I've defended my knight. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, I guess... I guess we'll push this edge pawn. Let's get my king escape hatch, which I might need later on. But also, I'm playing with fire a bit, and uh, <laughs> I 
this is getting complicated. Um, all right, we're going to put this bishop back. Crazy as that sounds, because it really limits my options. But also, it's not a bad position. Um, this is something in a similar position. I forget if it was Play Shogi or uh, Giko, or maybe both, that recommended that move. Uh, apologies. Let me get rid of the cat. I'll try to play this a bit more seriously. Sorry, I forgot I had that enabled. Often when I'm testing a live stream, I'll have that cat present. Um, I don't know. It's somehow calming. But yeah, we don't need that for this live stream. Sorry about that. Okay, we'll try to build something of a castle here. Hmm. I don't know how to meet that. Like, I want my rook to be active, but... So much is so confusing here. Um, think this is playable. We're getting into some sketchy territory here. But I guess maybe my bishop goes to 6-4. It's like try to do something. And if they play this bishop move, I can resist this way. And so now I've activated my bishop. It's unusual, but it seems to work. Having the bishop back in my hand gives me freedom to choose different things. I don't even know what, but... Um... I don't know what to do with my bishop. It feels like this has to be right, but it's so weird. It's such a bizarre play. Cause, like, I can't expect that they're just going to give me the lance. And normally it's useful to keep the bishop in hand so you can have many different options. Um, but here, like, all of my options revolve around this bishop being here, so... Now, I've blocked my rook with this knight move, which is clumsy, admittedly. Um... Hmm. Well, I've sufficiently confused myself. 
Um, guess we'll drop the rook back. Because I don't know what to do here. Oh, uh, curse to me. Now this just... Yeah, now I can kick my bishop. And my plan was to move it up forward. And that's not a good plan here anymore. So we'll play this way instead. Alright, let's do this obvious move and see what, how they respond. I need to free my bishop somehow, and this is one way to free it. So, yeah, potentially they either try to block on this file, which I don't think is going to work in the long term because I can just push the pawn. But um, also they could defend the silver or move it. But retreating is never fun. I say as my bishop has retreated already. Um... There's a lot of aggressive things they'd like to do in this position, because my position is... My castle is not super um, strong. There's things I could do to strengthen it, but instead I lashed out here, because this is a target. And this is a target. Um, well, plus I needed to activate the bishop. Didn't really have much choice there. They are giving me a piece if I want it. I'm not sure that I want it that badly. Actually, wait. Oh, this is a strong attack. Well, we have to do it. If they take the pawn, I could take the knight and I'm hitting the rook. So, yeah, they have to defend. Um, but that defense doesn't hold either. So do I take the rook? Um, how scared am I of a bishop? Or how useful does, is it for me to have the rook? Um, I think the rook is a really useful piece in this position. I don't want to check them because then the king runs. Um, all right, we'll attack the gold instead of attacking the king directly.
Oh, right. Like, all... None of my pieces are defended that well here. Oops. Um... Silly me. Need to be a bit more cautious. It's a fork, isn't it? It's a fork. Um, they say never run from a fork, but could this be the exception to the rule? Maybe. It's always slow to run from a fork. Um... I don't know why I did that. Still don't have a knight. Okay, now I have a knight. Sack the knight. I don't know how to attack. Sucks. Oh my god. Whatever. <sighs> I'm so bad at this.
All right. Woo! We won a game. Holy moly. That was intense. <laughs> this is five plus three stuff. In chess, it's one thing. In shogi, the end game just gets more intense throughout. Oh, gosh. Um. All right, I can play like this, right? Hmm. Oops, let's get the king out of here. Um... Ah, good game. Yes, that was exciting. Well, good is one word for it. I miss my Byoyomi. I really do. But who knows how long the tournament will go on for if we hit Byoyomi instead of increment. So, uh, they're wanting to initiate exchanges on the edge here. I'm wanting to initiate exchanges on the edge here, so... Exchanges are going to happen. Um... Let's not exchange bishops, though. Oh, this silver advance was extremely hasty on my part. I had ideas. They were okay ideas. They were not great ideas. But, um... This is going to get difficult. So... Fudge. <laughs> Fudge! I should not have played this way. I've made this game tremendously complicated. Alright. Let's make Gary Silver General useful somehow. Um... Hmm... so soon. Oh, it makes sense now. Alright, yeah. Because I can't retreat my bishop that particular turn, that seems like a good opportunity for them to do exactly what they did. So, what I'd been banking on is activating my bishop through the edge file. Um, we're going to do it. And it might suck, but it's an idea. So we're going to play an idea, and hopefully it won't suck too bad. Oh god. Uh, Alright. Well, we found an idea. It might be a bad idea, but we found... Oh... That stings so much. Um, hmm. All right, well, we have to give up the bishop. This sucks. <laughs> All right, well, I said we found an idea, and I was so proud of finding something. But this is going to be painful. In so many different ways. Assuming we can still feel pain at the end of it, you know. There might not be any pain if this... Oh, okay, like, everything's hanging here. They should have just taken this. It was an empty threat. Um, but they don't have to. Because their position's so dominant that they could play anything and, like, it's fine. Um... Hmm. All right. Well, this is silly, but we'll put the lance back. 
Right. Okay. <sighs> How in the world do I find an attack here? Um... Okay, well, I guess we're going to make room for this knight. Because there's, like, nothing else I can do to attack here. Um, that's dubious. Hang on, this allows me to repair my shape. We're making some very hasty re repairs to my shape. Um... Okay, we got a bishop back. That was weird. Um... Hey, that looks like a fun place for a lance. <laughs> A smart place? I don't know. But a place that I've never used a lance before, so I want to see how that goes. <laughs> um, problem is that I don't have an unlimited number of pieces. All right, I'll just trap my bishop in the corner. <laughs> that seems smart. Okay. I don't understand. Is there some trap here that I'm not seeing? I'll just keep blocking my rook with all of my pieces. Why have one piece block my rook when I can have all of my pieces block my rook? It's logical, right? Nah. People's comments aren't going to save me today. Um... Okay, we'll save the knight. Sack the rook. So the time control is five minutes with three second increment. Um, which leads to some panic stricken endgames. Um, which I guess are kind of exciting in a way. Wait, if I drop there, they just take it the night. I guess we have to prepare to drop a gold here or something. super subtle, aren't I? Alright. Um...
We still find some way forward. It might cost us material to do it, but we have to attack somehow. Uh, so now we can take back here. It occurs to me this guy's hanging the entire time. So I'm playing like on a knife edge already. Wait, no, this is defended by my lance. My cute little lance drop, which is probably not so smart, is actually saving this pawn. And then confusing the heck out of both of us. Yeah. Thank goodness I play fun moves. It makes both of us pay attention. Um, Alright, are you going to take this back? They do take back. Alright. Hey look, you have a gold general. Golds and kings tend to be nice targets. Especially when they're easy to hit. All right, sure, you can do that. Um, oh, they're still attacking my knight. Um, I don't want to put my silver here, because it's slow to do that. Alright, so I attack the square next to their king. I have a mate in one threat. Are they going to respond to it? They are. Alright, so this is not Shogi Wars, then. <laughs> Uh, wait, it's no longer a mate in one. Um, I mean, this keeps the king out of the corner, so I should still do it. See just how fun this lance is. Uh, sure, why not? Let's take it. I'm asking for trouble. Yeah, let's defend just a little bit. Um, Hmm, silver. Wait, they have one silver, though. Um, but yeah, I'm dead. Am I dead multiple ways? Probably. Um,
Hmm. Yeah, okay, you got this. Nicely done. I had too much fun that game. I attacked from my castle because I ran out of ideas and time pressure. But it's not like I had ideas before that. <laughs> I had some. I had dreams and hopes and aspirations. But yeah, this is a really tough field. Um, so maybe I should... I don't know. Playing fun moves is still something I'm going to do. Whether I should or not. But... Hmm. So our team is in 6th place out of 6. But hey, we placed. Got one more hour to try to turn this ship around. But, um... Yeah, maybe I need to stick more to Central File Rook. Wait, I can push this now. I might not be able to push it later. So let's push that. And then drop back. I we got a target there, which they've attended to. Um, but hey, this looks kind of fun. I'm just a bit tilted from last game, so I'm playing very quickly. Oh gosh. Well, that's what I get for being tilted. Um, it's not something good, but hey, it's a thing. So, yeah. Um, welcome to our world. I guess we're going to attack this pawn now. and trying to have something positive result from this, but it might be difficult. Uh, I don't know. I've not lost my rook yet, technically. And activate our pieces one or more ways. Okay, they... Uh, I don't even know anymore. I don't have a pawn in hand. Let's try to get a pawn in hand. Push this one, I guess, since bishops aren't exchanging. Mm, not what I wanted to see. All right, whatever. Let's do it. YOLO. <laughs> Can't stop me now or have a no good time. Having a ball can't stop me now. Okay. <laughs> well, oh, well, they stopped me. Um. All right. So yeah, what do we do? I don't know. How do we get another pawn in hand? How can we just sacrifice all of our pieces for pawns? Um. Hmm. Hmm. All right. I guess we'll put the rook over here. We've slowed them from castling, so it's not entirely a loss. Um... Sure. Why? Oh, this is dumb too. Because their silver is just going to walk up the board. 
and strike my rook. But no, then I can promote. Then their king can take my promoted pawn. I am on a roll. Yeah, I saw that too. Like, that didn't worry me as much as all the other problems. Um, that is a problem. just not quite as bad as all the other problems, despite being a problem. So, do I take with the bishop or with the rook? Well, either one that I take with, they drop a lance and I lose a piece. Also, if I don't take, they drop a lance and I lose a piece. That's cool. Um... All right, let's use a piece. Still don't have a pawn in hand. Um, I'll try to play a reasonable game. <laughs> I'm bearing in mind that like if I do anything sudden on the left side of the board, I'm going to be met. Well, here a lance drop might not be the worst thing in the world. Um, because I do have another file I can run to. So, yeah, let's drop back a bit. Now, I do have a pawn in hand, finally. There's not much I can do with it. I guess let's use it right away. This is risky, but I am out of ideas. So... We're going to play this idea, even though it's terrible. Um, and the idea is that I get to chase your king, at least for one move. All I'm trying to do is attack this king that's just so well defended. But yeah, my bishop was not useful, so I'm exchanging it. Of course, now they're not going to take it. So now I have a lance, and that lance could be useful. 
they attack my rook, my rook can move over and strike their promoted lance and threaten to promote here at the same time. Mm -hmm. So they're escaping my threat in advance. Um... Guess let's promote. This makes room for my rook to promote behind it. Not sure what they're doing. Okay, let's advance our rook. Um, okay, they've not trapped their own bishop. Attack the silver. Promote. I don't understand that exchange. Seems like if you're under attack, exchanging could be risky. I survived to fight another day. That was crazy. I'm starting to think my choice of opening might not suit me well. I get very difficult positions and suffer for a long time. But it makes for an exciting story at the end, doesn't it? Well, maybe it doesn't, because, like, 
If I performed better, that would also make for an exciting story. I want to show that I have a fighting spirit, but um, it's also kind of a bit challenging to do that while also trying to play really provocative moves. Um, yeah, I try to play Central Balrook. I endeavor. So we're going to stop this pawn. I'm going to stick our rook over here. And things are somehow going to be okay. Um, okay, we're going to oppose this in the most direct possible fashion. I don't even know whether to push my central foul pawn at this point. It's, we've both played some weird Joseki here. Um... Okay, so let's build Mino, or half Mino. It's been built. Like, I don't get any advantage from pushing the central foul pawn at this point. Actually, no, it's fine. This pawn is vulnerable for one turn. Now they block the diagonal to shut off my attack. And I cry. Um, I think this is playable done similar before. Okay. Normally I play the rook back. But this could be interesting. Let's play something greedy. Let's play tower amino. There it is. Transition to Silver Crown. There it is. Oh gosh. Wait, no. Yeah, I never missed a promotion chance back there. Um, I guess build out this castle one more. Something I'm not understanding about their play. Maybe I just got lucky or something. I don't know. Um, maybe I just got extremely lucky. Oh, that <laughs> should have been... No, I wanted us to actually have a team. If I put my own team together, like it would have had like two people on it. Folks wouldn't have joined in time. I don't mind the fact that like this team isn't named after me. Um, so... Yeah. Um, we could have put a team together in my name, and it would have been embarrassing. <laughs> I don't know. We could have made this Mifa's team. Um, I didn't see that. Alright, I guess I'm exchanging here. I guess we'll take the silver back and cry when we get hit in the face. 
just gonna happen any second now. All right, so I'm so confused. All right, I don't want a knight that badly. I'll take silver for a bishop or something, but I'm not going to exchange my bishop for a knight. Um. Well, we'll meet the obvious counter here. I just don't know. Like, their castle is a curious shape, but I have nothing to attack it with. I remember there's this scene from Austin Powers where he's being chased by a steamroller. Here, I am Austin, and just, like, there's this imminent demise that's just sitting on the horizon, and I'm gonna get crushed by the steamroller. Or I forget how the scene goes, even. But, like, there's this inoxorable sense of dread that, like, how the hell am I gonna survive this, let alone wage any kind of an attack here? Um, I have not completed my castle. They completed their castle, and yeah, I don't know how to attack either, <laughs> so. Oh, good news. Oh, I guess they made another movie after that one, didn't they? All right, well, yeah, um... See, if I just were, like, an action star in a movie, things would be okay. Alright, so my everything is hanging. Um, I guess, absent other ideas, I should attack the lance, but this pawn is hanging. And then the bishop will be hanging. This is not good. It's like the only thing I can do to defend that is put a silver down. And that makes more targets. Uh, I don't like this. Um... Guess we're gonna suck it up and just play what we have to play. <laughs> All right, so we'll chase down the slants because why not? I guess. Yay, we have a lance. Oh, it occurs to me this gold actually defends this pawn, so my threat to take the pawn is kind of an empty threat. <laughs> Or at least it should be an empty threat. But there are targets beyond the pawn, so... Maybe I should aim for those targets, eh? Sure. Let's remove the pawn this way, then.
It'd be kind of nice if we had a silver, so they're threatening to give us a silver. Can't really object to that. Um, this is dense, but it might work. Oh, I'm asking for trouble with that move. Oh, I'm asking for way more trouble than I thought with that move. Never mind. I didn't see that fork. I saw the rook going down one, because rooks don't move diagonally. But that's a dragon, not a rook. So yeah. How was your day? <laughs> This is not good. This is not good. <laughs> oh no. Um Okay, well I can take this for one turn. Oh, well never mind. Good game. You're right, you win. I might yeah. What do I even do? Okay. So we're seeing how actual shogi players play shogi. Okay. Fine. How do I even counter this thing? Sure, we'll play Static Rook, you know? We've tried everything else. Nothing else works. Let's play Static Rook. Uh, yeah, I'd seriously consider just playing the duck here. All right, the problem, I guess, is that I don't... I never castle anyway other than right side Mino. So this game is going to be really confusing for me. Left side Mino. Here we go. <laughs> totally sound. This is exactly how you play left side Mino Castle. Maybe. Maybe not. Hmm. Um. I guess we push this, because why not? Get one pawn in hand. Okay. I should keep reminding myself of how the Nifu rule works, and it's not to my advantage. Ah, <sighs> so now what? Um. Sure. How bad could this be? How bad could this be? Let's find out. Yeah, if I lose this game, it's because we didn't play the duck. Um,
Oh, congrats on the WSL game. That's very nice. Yeah. Take wins where you can get them. Well, we have a lance in hand now. Okay, I didn't seriously think I'd get to place it right away. Um, but we actually have a really good place to put it, so let's do that. Okay, so I can collect a knight, I guess. I'm confused. Like, clearly I'm getting the knight here. Yep, that knight is mine. It also becomes obvious just how confused I am. Alright, well. In for a penny, in for a pound? How bad could this be? We'll find out. Okay, we get another piece. Sure. It's consequence free actions are not a thing. Um. So, now what? We got a knight. We got a silver. If we're lucky, we might get other things. Oh, okay. Might have to be a little bit careful here, eh? Um, they have a mate in one threat, which I probably should do something about. Yeah, I am dead. <laughs> I am already dead. Oh, no. I am more than dead. Alright, so what do we do now? Sure, let's try to defend. Why not? That is an epic lance drop. It really is. Okay, oh. Wait, what? Oh, they have two golds. Never mind. You have this. Congratulations. All right. <laughs> See, that's how you checkmate. Oh, man. So, yeah, I would think it extremely presumptuous to call uh, Team Shogi Harbor my team in this match. Um, Because I am not the one carrying the team today. All right, we'll put it on the fourth file. Let's just try every opening today. One of these openings has got to work. So... There's Half Mino, Castle. Here's me playing my Silver up to defend. Oh, interesting. Wait, but the... 
Something is odd about this shape. I'm not sure exactly what. Um... Hmm. Wish I had a pawn. I don't have a pawn. Okay, we're gonna attack the old dumb way. Um. Okay, I am very confused. Let's see how this plays out. I'm out of ideas. This would be a good time to have an idea. All right, let's do this idea. Welcome. Oh, I see. Yeah, you're not wrong that he could put the picture of that avatar up. Um, I mean, I think it's okay, though. Like, my main goal wasn't to promote myself. My main goal was, like, as I stated, with our team objective, to have some good games, learn something together, have fun. Um, I don't know if I'm doing well on the having good games front. I'm getting killed. But, um... At least it's entertaining for the rest of y'all. <laughs> I can't drop a pawn here. I wanted to drop a pawn right there. I can't do that. Ah, this game is difficult. And I'm playing like a noob. I'm trying, but it's so hard. Yeah. So. Also scared away the king from the one square where I could potentially get a king dragon fork if he's not paying attention. But I guess on the bright side, if the king goes back, I can drop the bishop and sack it for the gold and then take this knight. And then threaten to take the lance. Like, I have something of a plan there. It's just, it's not supposed to work. Um, but yeah, I guess throughout these games I've just tilted more and more, and it's not serving me well. Yeah, yeah, we need we need reinforcements. So. What the heck, let's do it. How bad can this be? We're gonna find out. But yeah, I think it's just cool that they have the event. And I thought it was good that... I mean, certainly um, it was asked in the Discord channel if anybody 
is interested in um, organizing a team for this, um, let the rest of the channel know. Um, I think organizing a team is a bit much of a responsibility. Um, but playing in this thing's fun. This is so sad. Running away. Lost a whole move here. Oh. Wait. Are they going to place both bishops just to trap my dragon? Actually, they'll try to, but I can run away first. So they've got, like, two silvers and a bishop in this corner defending against my dragon which isn't even going to be there in just a second. But further, this bishop is, like, trapped now. I just drop a gold and I win it. But that invites a fork if my dragon's still here, so... I don't know. Uh, yeah, it's supposed to be a streamer event. Yeah. I'm sure the... Like, so this event started where I'm at. It started 6 a.m. Um, I'm not going to manage in most days to muster an audience at 6 a.m. Um, so, I mean, I get that, like, it's typical, or it's great that they have, like, five other folks, uh, their teams live streaming it, and here I, I am doing the best I can to represent our little Discord, but, yeah, um, it's great that they invite us. <laughs> And they picked an excellent hour, as best an hour as we can possibly get for this event to happen. Um, it's just really hard to make it a streamer event for folks out in the West. Uh, and also a streamer event for folks in Japan. It's just challenging to do, but we did it. And yeah, it's hard to imagine that it being done any better, because we did it well. Um, all right, so there's the obvious threat of night takes here, which I don't know what to do about. Um, <laughs> here, if you can do night takes, I can do night takes. That seems fair, right? I don't think either of us looked at this move. I just played it because it looked fun. But um, it seems to actually be a good move. The problem is that my dragon can't like partake in this attack now. Um... Oh, actually, now if they take the pawn, I could do a pawn drop right next to their castle. So we'll pretend I planned that. Um, man, it's not easy having so limited pieces to work with. All right, let's add the lance to this fight.
encouraging them to carry out their threat. <laughs> hmm. Problem is, if that my move doesn't checkmate, I'm kind of dead. But let's hope it checkmates. Um. Hmm. They don't have a gold general. I think this mates. Hang on, before I do that... I'm sorry, this is simply mates, so let's not delay it any further. Thanks for the game. I want a game! Hooray! But yeah, I am not leading this team. We are in a solid sixth place. So, Fried Oysters, ARCE, Magic Show, Nero Victory, Intel March are leading our team, among others. It is a tough event out there. Our average performance is 12-12. We are there in spirit. We are very much there in spirit today. Okay. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> this seems solid, right? How could this possibly go wrong? All right. Sure, let's push this too, just for fun. Okay, my king's safe. My king is perfectly safe. Unless I get checkmated. But when's that going to happen? Um. <laughs> okay, what? Really? Really now? <laughs> okay. I knew my attack was kind of BS, but I'm being called out on it at this point. Just how sketchy my attack is. See, I got a rook and a pawn attacking. I'm even going to have a pawn in hand. What could go wrong? Uh, okay. Um... Everything's fine. There, we got our pawn back. Oh, fudge. Fudge sickles. All right, we didn't need the rook anyway. Um, this might be difficult. We have two lances. So let's use one. Okay, let's use the other one. Um, except now I'm checkmated. Okay, let's step out of the mate in one. Yeah, whatever. You win. Good game. That was too fun. I got carried away. Sorry.
Shogi's supposed to be fun. Um, Alright. Here, let's open with the center pawn, because that's what the last opponent did. And it worked really well for them. Let's put the rook there. Okay. Sure. We'll just float the rook. Okay, now everything's hanging all at once. Sweet. Alright. Um... Mm-hmm. There. We've trapped my rook. That's interesting. Hmm. Okay. We are playing the delayed Urashino opening. You might not have heard of it because it's not a thing, but um Oh, they even have a counter to it. Damn. Just I thought I had something for once. Can't I ever have a creative idea that like works out? It's hard to invent on a game that's been around for so long. Um, it really is. And I guess I'm not giving the folks who actually do invention enough credit. Um, hmm. That's surprising. All right, whatever. I want to exchange stuff on this side of the board, so let's exchange. Sure, why not? Oh, you get a knight? Oh, okay. Um, hmm. Didn't realize we're exchanging quite this much. Wait, I am confused. So I'm giving up a silver to do this thing. But this position is kind of interesting. Sure, we'll exchange this too. <sighs> I don't know what I'm doing.
So, yeah, I need more pieces. I have pawns in every file. No, actually every file. I was going to say except one, but I actually have them in every file. Um, so it's difficult to drop a pawn in this situation. Um, If there's no king rook fork just yet. Give it time. I'll show, I'm sure I'll find a way to drop my rook. I've trapped my own rook right now, haven't I? If they start adding more pieces around the board, yeah, my rook has nowhere to go. So, how do I do something about that? I don't know. Blitz is super rough. With chess, I tell players not to get addicted to Blitz. Here, clearly, like, the addiction's real. <laughs> yeah, so they find the surround as I found it after I moved. Um, sure, let's sack the rook. And then attack a silver. Problem is they have a bishop drop to counter my bishop drop. Um, but I don't know, this deforms their shape or something. Um... Also, this might not be where they wanted to put the bishop. Hmm. Can't imagine that's where they want the bishop. Mm-hmm. Sack this while we still can before they take here and undermine our knight. Hmm. I might have just solidified their shape. Okay, let's attack the knight, because I'm low on ideas. Also, because this knight will be a nuisance eventually. Maybe I could actually use a knight somehow. Hopefully I can use a knight, because it looks like I'm going to get one soon. Whether I want it or not. Um...
Oh, that was maybe dumb. I thought it was taking a gold. It's okay. I probably confused him too. Okay, I think we can drop the pretenses and say that I'm dead lost here. Um, maybe not from an engine perspective, but I have 12 seconds and a hideous, hideous position that looks insalvageable. Just kidding, I can't put a pawn there. Um, I knew that. Yeah, whatever. You got this. Good game. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of people uh, who play chess take Blitz seriously and don't realize that you can't learn anything in that kind of time control situation. Alright, we're playing Static Rook today. Unless we exchange the bishops. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know why I did this. It'll be fun to see if I can actually play one of these. Okay, we put the king here or something. And then, like, play this and... I don't know, something like that. And... this is where... Maybe we bring the silver out from the left to uh, attack on the right, I guess. I don't know. I've never played this before. But the game's not going to... Well, I mean... No, there's ten minutes left in the tournament. And we both have five minutes plus increment. This game's not going to conclude before the tournament ends. Um, so... Yeah, I don't remember all this stuff, how it goes, but something like this, I guess. And then I'm supposed to sack this pawn earlier or later. I don't remember. I'm a bit excited at the moment. Uh, yeah, I guess after this, sure, why not? Why not? We've been playing two hours, lost almost all of our games, hung more pieces than we can count. 
Um, did manage to win some though, so it's not all for not. Um, it's just I don't have a plus score at this moment. Um, hmm. Sure, this looks reasonable, right? <laughs> Maybe? I don't know. So, they can take my silver and I can chase the rook. Maybe. I think I'm supposed to play this at some point in the line. I guess they take this pawn. And I don't know if I can move my silver to safety if I have time for that. It looks like I have time for this, so I'm going to play it. Trying to win a game for our team before the tournament ends. So we're attacking the center point. Oh. Well. You're not supposed to do that. Um, I mean, yes, they stopped my rook. Okay. I get that. But, um, unless, maybe I'm trapping my bishop here in a way that allows them to ensnare it with their pieces, but I don't think so. Like, yeah, the rook can move over, but then my bishop gets this escape square here. Alright, so we get the rook after all. And then we could play our rook to the open file that suddenly exists. Yeah, there's a lot of really strong players in this tournament. So, so many strong players. And now we have some idea just how strong they are. <laughs> We had the slightest inkling of an idea before this tournament, and now the further we get into this, um, the stronger we realize that they actually are. Alright, let's get the rook out of this line so we're not hanging it for nothing. Also so the opponent has to, well I say has to, but apparently doesn't have to do something about my threat. Um. Okay. Sure, I'll save my silver this way. Um, this looks interesting. So I'm attacking the castle from the front and the back here. Also, my token is going to make its way over. And I have another rook to add to the fight. So, I'm not sure that that's worth a lance for them to allow all this craziness here. But what do I know? Hmm. I mean, I think on Shogi Wars, it's not a matter of folks just sitting for the sake of trying to... I don't know. I don't even know why you would sit on Shogi Wars if you had the option to promote, but... It's really hard to get Shogidors, uh, Shogidors one Don, just given the way their rating system works. Um, sure, let's take here. Um...
Okay, we're going to chase the silver. Because we need another piece. I mean, maybe I could have taken the lance here. Taking the lance would have been faster for sure than just chasing this. But the silver is worth more. But maybe a lance is exactly what I needed. Yeah, know what I needed. Well, I'm sorry. If they bring the horse back, then yeah, I'll take here. Sure. Yeah, so they don't. So let's activate this. Um, yes, I am deeply perplexed because it looks like my opponent's dead. Like, yeah, I don't understand this taking the knight. Um, Hmm, this is not easy. I thought this could be easy. Whatever. <sighs> yeah. Wait a second. Oh, that's not checkmate. I thought that was checkmate. But they have a lance. All right. Uh, let's protect the diagonal. Scary. I don't know what to do. Hmm. 
This bishop is a monster. We have to remove it. No monsters here. I have a mate threat now. No, it's not, because they can take my damn piece. Um... Okay, let's actually support our mate threat. Now I have bishop takes threatening mate. Alright. Phew! That'll do it. Didn't count. Didn't count in the time limit, but you know, we'll take it. Whew! Alright, well, congratulations to everybody who won a game or who lost a game today. <laughs> um, every game's a learning experience. And I think today's lesson for me is play with the Bio Yomi, because, like, this blitz stuff is too hard. It really is. Yeah. Um, I'm sure if we were to run an engine across some of our games today, it would point out a lot of tactics. But, like I said, it's far easier for most players to find moves when you have time to think about the moves. And unlike chess, uh, Shogi just gets more and more complex toward the end game. So we did what we could, and we finished in sixth place. So yeah, congrats to everyone who appears here. Um, I appear in 16th place, not even showing on your overlay or on this live stream, but whatever. Um, yeah, and then other teams had really strong performances, so you know, everybody's super excited about playing in this event. I hope we all enjoyed that. Thanks for watching.